Hi. Hi. How's it going? Awful. I can't talk to these people. Ah, well, then don't. Come on, let me buy you another orange juice. You know, this whole scene is really getting on my nerves. All these people talking about Call condos. Two oranges. Ski trips. I don't know how Stacy can stand it. I mean, she's so real compared to these bozos. You know, I could be wrong, but uh, I don't think she looks too thrilled. I don't know. I do. Now, come on, this thing isn't going to last that long, and then the two of you can go out and have fun all by yourselves. Yeah. You know, the evening is still going to be great. Oh, my God. What? All the stuff I just said about the evening being great, I take it all back. What? Trouble just stepped off the elevator. Tell me I'm hallucinating here. Why? I can't believe that you actually got off that elevator with Cecile. Well, I did. I mean, her of all people, you should be running the other way. Well, Cecile's not all bad. Oh, no, not all bad. She's got one or two percent. It's just merely disgusting. I decided to give her another second chance, that's all. To do what? Ruin you? I still have feelings for her. So do I. Loathing. She's bad for you. You know it. I know it. She knows it. She loves it. Will you lighten up? It's not that terrible. You're right. It's worse. Get her out to the balcony. don't have a conscience, you stay young forever. Okay, you two. My ears were burning. Yes, well, I was asking Cass when you were going back to Tankir. Oh, nice to see you too, Felicia. Actually, I haven't given that a second thought. I couldn't possibly, not until after I've established the memorial fund for Mac. Oh, gee, I'd love to hear about this fund. Oh, and I'd love to tell you about it, but some other time. You do look wonderful, though. <laughs> no, no, you, you haven't given me the details yet, Cecile. Well, I will. Later, darling. If I'm going to get donations, I have to spread the word. Oh, by the way, where's Mitch? Why? Well, I just haven't seen him, that's all. Oh, gee, Mitch has all the luck. Um, he's out of town, huh? Yeah, not this <sighs> afternoon. Really? Mm-hmm. Now, why is it that all the men in your life are always... Someplace else. Oh, knock it off, will you? No, no, it's all right, Cass. I understand the concepts of trust and loyalty are completely foreign to poor little Cecile. Well, I need a little air. I'll be out on the balcony. Funny. I don't remember Felicia as being that touchy. Well, you do that to everyone, Cecile. It's a gift you have. 